New numbers are out tonight. They show that telephones may be to blame for a big spike in pedestrian accidents on the roadway. Emergency room visits blamed on phone use are now up 84% since 2007, which is the same year Apple introduced the iPhone. Pedestrian fatalities have also risen almost 50% since 2009, while traffic deaths overall are up 11%. 7 Eyewitness News reporter Ed Riley shows us tonight that distracted driving here is not the only problem. They're not, there's no glancing over the shoulder. They're constantly looking at their phone. Society is becoming more and more distracted by technology. I mean, I've been walking city streets and people bump into me from behind because they're on their phones. And the distractions have become a serious safety hazard for everyone. They were starting to veer right? No signal or anything. Vanessa Elder is an avid cyclist who works at the campus bike shop in Buffalo. She recently had a close call when a car nearly drove into her. And I kind of just like slipped by, but I totally saw him like checking his phone, like kind of like down here. And Groups like the AAA have been working to raise awareness of the dangers of distracted driving, especially in cars with infotainment systems. Even pro driving instructor Carrie Donnelly could not reprogram an in-dash navigator without taking her eyes off the road for close to 30 seconds. They always assume that everything is going to get better with more technology, but that's not always the case. Distracted driving is not the only problem. Distracted walkers are also creating a safety risk as they cross streets without paying attention. Even myself, when I'm walking down the street, there are times that my husband will point out to me that I am completely distracted. During lunchtime in downtown Buffalo, we found numerous people crossing while carrying on cell phone conversations, checking messages, and wearing earbuds and headphones. All things the National Safety Council is strongly advising against. Walking is one of the healthiest ways to get around town. The council now has a distracted walking website with an instructional video in hopes of reminding people of the importance of getting there safely. Companies like AT&T have developed free apps for the cell phone that will prevent you from sending or receiving messages while you are driving. But safety experts say it will take more than that. It will also take an awareness of everyone of just how dangerous it is to be a distracted driver or a distracted walker. In Buffalo, Ed Riley, 7 Eyewitness News. Buffalo.